In this guide, you will learn about CINAHL, the Commutative Index for Nursing and Allied Health Literature, one of the most comprehensive sources available for nursing and allied health information. CINAHL is a research database that indexes research studies, journal articles, citations to nursing dissertations, selected conference proceedings, standards of practice, and book chapters from over 3,000 nursing and allied health journals. You use it to search for articles that relate to your research topic. You may be asking yourself, why use CINAHL? Well, the results are automatically limited to nursing-related resources. Using CINAHL provides fewer results to skim through when compared to searching the open web or Google. CINAHL also has built-in tools that help you narrow your search results, and it has more full text. To access CINAHL, you begin at the library's homepage, library.walsh.edu. Then you select the Articles tab. From there, you select the Databases A to Z link. Now select the C tab, and then select CINAHL Complete from the listing. You will arrive at the Advanced Search page of CINAHL. It's tempting to jump right in into CINAHL and run a search for your question. For example, let's say we are interested in the relationship between patient positioning and pressure sores among elderly patients. If you just type that whole phrase into CINAHL, you won't get any results. The reason is CINAHL doesn't handle long questions very well, like the one that we just searched for. You'll get much better results if you use keywords. Keywords are the words or phrases that describe the central ideas or the main concepts associated with your research topic. So here are the main concepts for our research question. Pressure sore is the condition that we're trying to treat. Patient positioning is the intervention that we are look, thinking about using. And elderly is the population that we're working with. Now let's try typing in those three concepts, pressure sore, patient positioning, and elderly into the first search box. Do not use any commas or other punctuation. What do we get? No results are found. Databases like CINAHL are very literal. They only search for all of the words that you type in exactly as you type them in. That's why you got few, if any, results in the last search. We didn't get any. What we're really interested in are articles that contain the keywords pressure sore and patient positioning and elderly patients. Unfortunately, most databases don't automatically add the and in between your terms like Google does. The easiest way to add and in all of the terms together in the search box is to type one keyword into each box. So we will type the following into this in all search boxes. Type pressure sore into the first search box. Type patient positioning into the second. And then we'll skip the elderly concept for now. We got 122 results. Not only are databases very literal, they're also kind of dumb in the sense that they won't automatically look for different terms that describe the same concept. Therefore, it's up to you to think about possible alternative keywords and plug them into your search using OR. Let's take our first concept, pressure sore. Another way to say it is pressure ulcer, and some people say dubiquitous ulcer as well. Let's add these words to our search. So I have typed into CINAHL, pressure sore or pressure ulcer or dubiquitous ulcer and patient positioning. Now we have 659 search results. Thinking of good keywords can be hard, but start with what you know and then scan your results for alternative terms that you might be able to use in your search. For example, if we skim these titles in our results list, we'll come to this one repositioning for pressure ulcer prevention in adults. Repositioning could be another useful way to express the patient positioning concept. So let's add it to our search. 
Another great place to look for keywords is the abstract or the summary of the article. These summaries provide a quick overview of the article's main points and conclusion. You can find the abstract by clicking on the article title, which will open up the detailed record for that article. Keep in mind, however, that some articles in CINAHL don't have abstracts.